Today we're going to demonstrate passkey login with your Apple and Google account via the web. Passkeys are being proposed to eliminate the need to remember and manage passwords. They perform the same security function as a hardware security key, giving you the highest level of protection possible. If you're interested in a primer on passkeys, click on the link to our video above. Unbeknownst to you, when Google and Apple both implemented passkeys, they automatically created a private key on your phone to authenticate to your Google account or your Apple ID. There was nothing that you had to do on your part, so what we'll do is we'll just demonstrate this. We're going to log in to this Authentrend account, and we're going to select the iPhone iPad here. Next, and we're presented with a QR code. We'll go over to the phone and launch the Lens application on the Android phone. And we'll scan the QR code. It'll say use passkey. So we'll select that. You can skip the QR code if you want. We're going to select not now. It'll connect the two devices together. It's asking me to authenticate to the phone now. And once you're authenticated to the phone, you're logged into the account. Next, we'll go and demonstrate the passkey login to your Apple ID account. We'll call up the Apple phone. So we have the iPhone over here. And we'll scroll down to where it says sign in. And because we have Bitwarden as our password manager that has our account IDs, we can just use the Control Shift L. We're going to select Sign In with Pass Key. And again, you want to select the iPhone, iPad, Android device. You'll be presented with a QR code just like before. We'll come over to the camera, open the camera to there, and where it says Sign In with Pass Key here on the screen, we'll just select Sign In with Pass Key. We're going to connect the two devices. After that, it will ask us to authenticate to the device. Select Continue to Authenticate to the device. Authenticated with the Face ID. And you're signed into the account. Just that simple. There's a couple quick things I want to go over on the login with the Android phone on using a pass key. We're going to log into the account again. And when we click over here on use pass key it's going to ask us to turn on bluetooth that is something you have to have on in order to use the pass keys is bluetooth so we turn that on here it presents an option to skip the qr code the thing i found out on the android phone is that even though you select this to skip the code it, it's still going to ask you to scan the qr code every time you log in and i've tried that on three different browsers with the same results What's important to note there is that nothing was done on your part, either on the Google account or the Apple ID. These pass keys were automatically created. You have a secure private key stored on the Android phone and the iPhone for account login. If you're interested in how we mirrored the devices, we'll click on the link above. Some things to consider about pass keys. As you saw in the video, they're automatically created for your Apple and your Google accounts, so there was nothing for you to do. You can use these to log in via the web. You have a much better experience logging in because now you don't have passwords to remember or to manage. They're using the same private public key security as a hardware security key, offering you some of the greatest protection possible for logins. These pass keys are stored on the device in a private key and never leave the device. So therefore, if something gets hacked out on the web, as far as a server, your credentials are not going to be hacked along with it. The pass keys can be synchronized across devices. So that means once a pass key is registered with the Google or Apple account, it's available across all of your devices. And finally, I think we can all look forward to pass keys becoming standard for passwordless login and stop having to worry about creating and managing passwords. That's it for today's video demonstrating secure logins with pass keys on your Apple iPhone and Google Android phone. Before we go, please like the video and subscribe to the channel for more tech tips to protect your digital life. Share your passkey experiences in the comments below. We're always happy to help. Have a great and wonderful hack-free day.